uh, you know, especially since I, I, I did what I set out to do, I uh, brought your brother home. Is Dante okay? He is now. How are you doing? I'm great. You sure? What? Yeah. Wait. Mom got to you, didn't she? What did she do? Run over here with a bunch of hysterical accusations about Shiloh? Is that why you asked me over here? Because you're siding with her? I wasn't going to say this in front of Christina, but if Jason wanted to kill you, you would be dead. Well, then maybe I should press charges for my own protection. I'm not trying to make excuses for him or anything, but it, it is exactly what you said to Christina. He totally overreacted. You have to understand, he's a pretty overprotective father to both Danny and Jake, and I would just hate for the boys to lose any sort of time with their father. Wouldn't well, you think that that guy's a decent role model? Really, someone who uses violence? instead of their words. I don't know. I mean, I, I guess, I guess the, that's where it comes to you. I mean, the dawn of day, it teaches us all about forgiveness, right? I mean, I've read it in your book. Forgiveness leads to a lighter heart. I'm just hoping you believe that for Danny's sake. What do you know about Shiloh? <laughs> I have nothing to say without my attorney. You set him up, didn't you? You waited for him to make the first move. Shallow touched you first, and then you laid him out. Now, I helped you out by getting him to admit it. I got the waitress to corroborate that Shiloh was talking at you for at least 10 minutes. Now, your lawyer can subpoena my notes. She can take the waitress's statement and allege that you were provoked. If the DA tries to file charges, they won't make it past the first arraignment because everything that you did was deliberate. You could have killed Shiloh. And you wanted him to know it. Why? Is he threatening someone close to you? Because he is threatening someone close to me. Thank you so much for meeting me. Uh, you said it was important. What's going on? I wanted to see you and Wiley because I'm leaving Port Charles. And I wanted to see my son one last time. You need to relax, because I didn't call you over here to side with your mother. I miss you. And I just want to lay eyes on my girl. Thanks. Sorry. I've... Everyone's just been so judgmental. Yeah. I really do appreciate how supportive you've been. And you and Sam. In fact, you and Carly should take some of the seminars. I know you've already read Charlotte's book, but I brought a copy for Carly. And this pamphlet has a bunch of the upcoming courses. I think you and Carly would really benefit from them. Why well, don't mention it to me? I hope you do. Okay, I just want, I gotta get something out in the open. Your mother came by here yesterday. She's concerned. So am I. You've had a tough couple of years, and we've, we're hoping that you, you, you're not being pressured into doing something that you don't want to do. You think I'm not gullible? No, because I have faith in you, and I want you to be happy. But I need you to tell me why you're choosing Donna Day over your own family. Dawn of day is a...